Welcome to another edition of the Grilling Oasis, where we enjoy uh, grilling, um, finding relaxation, just having a good time. Uh, so today, fam, we're going to do steaks. I like steaks. Um, and the thing about a steak is everybody have a different way of cooking steaks. So I'm going to show you my way today. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, while we cook our steaks, we're going to talk about some positive which is peace. How do you find peace in your life? You know, peace means just feeling a safetyness, a, a security. Uh, it means having a state of mind that you're free of disturbance. So as we grill, you know, we're going to talk a little bit about peace. Uh, so let's look at these steaks. So here go our steaks. As you can see, one of the key components to a good steak is the cut of the meat. Uh, so we actually got uh, some good cuts of meat. Here, uh, we marinated them overnight, uh, and then we put our seasoning on them. Let the seasoning set for about 30 minutes on top. Uh, and so now we're going to stick them on, on the grill. So we got our uh, different woods we're going to use. We're going to use some mesquite, some cherry, and some pecan wood. We're going to stick it over the fire, and then we're going to uh, put our steaks on top of that. So we got our wood on top of there, our cherry, mesquite, and pecan. Uh, as the wood catches, we're going to stick the steaks on it so to get that wood flavor on them. So see how the fire is going? We got our covered hand with glove. Make sure you put your glove on. You don't want to make anybody sick using your hand. Stick it on top of the fire. Just like that. Now, you'll notice that our steaks are not seasoned on, on the other side. That's because we like to season ours on the grill. Uh, because we don't want any seasonings to be lost. You know, look at the juices right there. So when you season them on, on one side and flip it over, the juices sometimes wipe it off. So we're going to season them now. So we got our seasoning on top now. You see how the fire is searing the heat in. So we're going to cover it up and then we'll be back in a couple minutes to flip them over. All right, fam. So we're going to check on the steaks. See how the fire going pretty good. So we're going to flip them over. Look at that. Looks real good, doesn't it? All right, so we're going to move this one out of the way because it ain't. We don't want it to burn up. Same with this one. I don't want them to burn. I don't want to burn up the good steaks. So actually, we're going to stick this one on the side. It's on the side like that. So it still get, still get some heat at that sear. Let it sear right quick. So that sears in the flavor and the juices. Now we can move it to the side and let it cook. All right, so we're going to let them cook, y'all. All right, fam. We're going to check on the meat again. As you can see, that fire going good up under there. Get that one out the way. Look at that. Nice, nice flavors. Going to be in there from that wood. So now we're going to measure our temperature because we like to... Uh, know where we at in the stream cooking. So just got my little temperature reader here. Well done is 160. So it's not quite there yet. Well, it is up, up there. Looks like. But here, 150, 163. What about there? 138. Let's see. What about here? 133. 136. 127. 166. So this one over here is cooking pretty good. So we don't want we don't want that one to get overly cooked. So we're gonna kind of move it. 
out of the way just a little bit. We're going to leave this one where it's at. We're going to move this a little bit closer here. Some of that wood can hit it. Like that. Like that. Kind of got our U shape going right around the center of the fire. We want to, we want it to cook evenly. All right, so we're going to come back and check it in a little while, y'all. All right, fam. So we're going to look at these steaks. So see that fire going real good. We want it by 160 and above. Yep, that's she done. It's done right there. 158, 160. All right, so as the last thing, we put butter on top of the steaks, and then we let the fire kind of lick it up. So a piece of butter right there, two pieces of butter. You'll notice fire going to like it. I'm going to put it over the fire so that it kind of, that's that last Last thing that we're gonna do. So, and as she melts, that's gonna be good right there. All right, cover it up for about 30 seconds, and then gonna take it off. All right, so we covered it up for 30 seconds. Now we're ready to take her off. Let's put it on into our little pan here. All right, dog. There she go, y'all. Uh, she looks good. Got the butter on there, sizzling. That's going to be a good steak right there, family. So as you mentioned earlier, fam, we were talking about peace. So don't let nobody steal your peace. That's the inequality that you have within yourself. And... You know, what we all have for peace, it varies. Some people listen to music for peace. Some people like to read books. Some people cook like me. You know, this brings me peace. Grilling so that you guys can watch it. I get peace that way. Uh, and when you have peace, you're able to sleep better. Uh, you feel better about yourself. You have uh, a way to cope with uh, the trials and stresses you have in life, uh, depression, illnesses, things like that. So find your peace, family. Hey, if you like the video, hit the like, subscribe, refer your friends, and uh, we're going to keep doing this. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time on the Grilling Oasis. Peace.